So what we're talking about is how do I, we're talking about you, how do I in my human form, how do I know when to dig in and try harder? And when do I know when to just release it to the universe? And we say, always release it to the universe. <laughs> always release it to the universe. And if you do enough of that, you'll start getting tuned in and you'll start feeling impulses to do things. And when you feel the impulse, do it. Now, this is an important distinction. You all have been doing a measure of that your whole life. And sometimes you get an impulse to do something, but you talk yourself out of it because you don't think that that impulse is the most important thing on the list because your mother told you that when you were little, you wanted to do this. She wanted you to do that. So you've been trained by your parents, by your teachers, by the people that you live with. You've been trained by other selfish people around you that what matters to you isn't the most important thing that you should get your work done and then play. And that's the equivalent of saying you should get yourself all jacked up and all full of resistance. And then you should expect blessings from the universe. That's what that's saying. No. So you want to give yourself permission to let these universal forces, this is energy that creates worlds. This is conscious that knows where you stand in relationship to everything you want and knows what your best attention is right now. And really once you've launched something, your best intention for a long while is to get out of the way and let the cooperative components gather. And when they're gathered and when you're in sync with that, non-physical consciousness, you'll receive an impulse and it will be a big one.